What's good, y'all? I'm not exactly in the most private place ever, so I'm gonna keep this quick. So, um, it's November 4th, and uh, while everybody's distracted by all this, you know, election stuff, you know, I noticed that uh, the sun is still beaming, and uh, people close to me have noticed that, uh, you know, it might not be like this where you live, but where we live, the the trees, usually the leaves would have then changed colors and fell off by now, but they're not. Uh, some of the trees have changed colors a little bit, but most of them are still green. They still got the leaves on them. Um, I was thinking about when this kid ran up on me and my brother not too long ago. I was asked about our hair. He was growing his hair out. And uh, basically, you know, just talking about how, how long it takes to grow. And uh, when I first started growing my hair, I used to do stuff like that too. But um, <clears throat> you see all this stuff going on in the sky. You see all these lights in the sky at nighttime. You see the moon doing what it's been doing. And uh, the sun is still beaming in November. You know what I'm saying? This is, it's November. So just something I've been thinking about how uh, if you notice, they're rediscovering a lot of animals that they thought went extinct, a lot of lizards and snakes and tarantulas and turtles. And uh, even more than that, a lot of different plants that they've either thought had gone extinct or they've never seen before. Same with the animals. They're finding animals that they've never seen before all throughout the Americas, especially South America. And uh, right now, you know what I'm saying? If you're an original, if you look like this, if you got hair like this, 4C hair, anything like that. <clears throat> it's like we're in a, uh, an oven of gamma radiation, photon, light, pretty much all that good stuff that comes from the sun. And uh, like I've been saying, you don't need as much food. People that I know that, uh, you know, normally partake of herb, you know, we notice we don't need as much of that as we used to either to get you know where we try to go um but yeah you're gonna start to notice plants are gonna grow faster trees are gonna grow faster if you're natural you made a carbon your skin's gonna be glowing dna is gonna be building your hair is gonna grow faster if you're not i put it like this if you're not aligned with nature, it's gonna start hurting you a lot faster. I know there's a lot of people that are younger than me, and I probably look kind of old, but um, it's a lot of people that are younger than me, you know, 23, 24, 25, and I notice those people that don't look like me are going bald. Uh, same with like a well, not even just the younger ones, obviously the older ones, but uh, you get what I'm saying. I'm noticing that uh, whatever's going on in the sky is like ramping up and we're getting more energy from the sun, even though they're trying to make it feel cold, the ice age is over. So, you know what I'm saying? Don't let the fake ass clouds they put up there, don't let them, uh, get you bent out of shape. They might make it cold for maybe like 30, 40 minutes, but I notice if I go outside, them clouds run. If you're like me and you get in this, you go outside when it's cloudy, you cloud busting. You ain't got to use no extra stuff. You can do what some of the people say and get the, uh, the white vinegar or whatever, but I don't need it. I can go outside and work out and uh, do some squats, do some push-ups, run a little bit, do some ab workouts, them clouds get gone. Cause they're really not even clouds, they're chemtrails. 
regardless, they get gone. They can't handle this shit. And neither can these parasitic entities that's out here either. So don't let anything discourage you. If you know what I know, and you like me, really, you know we already won. Can't lose. That's all I got to say.